no, 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 the channel Anvil C8 Pisces Gills right now has been disbanded. You could never guess why. So Star Citizen has been one of those games I've been curious about for a while now, but there's a major reason why I haven't tried it out yet. Jeez, this is so laggy. Yeah, I'm frame jumping like a maniac. All performance bullshit aside, a buddy convinced me to try it out. So I created a character and did the unthinkable. The tutorial. All right, drink. Yeah. You just throw it out on the floor? Yeah, just gonna litter right in your own fucking place. Like an absolute pig. Put your helmet. I wish it was tab to uh, access that shit, but I guess not. Um, oh, it's right there. I need to pay attention to the visual things. So I got the basic UI stuff down, but that's not why I need a tutorial. I needed to prepare myself to become a pilot. Top left menu. Where the fuck's the top left menu? You could literally go down and interact with all of that. That's bananas. Okay, to be completely transparent, I was warned about the complexity of this game, but I didn't think it would be too hard if I tackled it with a simple-minded approach. But finding out all these buttons on the touchscreen were interactable, man, how the hell am I gonna get a grip on flying? Okay, so space bar. Oh, holy, holy fuck. You gotta be careful. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm already all over. I'm like spinning around like crazy right now, bro. Holy Are crap. Are you in first person? Yeah. So put your cursor in the middle of the screen. Okay, yep. Now, how do I... All right, so there's a roll. How do I roll, actually? What the fuck? Q and E. Wow, why would it roll like that? I was getting used to the basics of flight. I followed the tutorial, flew to each checkpoint they asked me to, learned to quantum travel to POIs, contact ports for landing permission. I felt like I'm finally becoming a true star citizen. Till they asked me to land. No, 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 no. Now that none of that counted towards shit because it was a tutorial. You you definitely can't fly it like an impatient maniac. Like you absolutely need to be patient. That's why I told you you gotta be careful with like your exiting and entry. All I know is, dude, my flying is going as shitty as I thought I was gonna go. What you're trying to do now is bring me to a better place that has a better hab necessarily. Uh yeah, where it's not fucking all cracked up. So we finally teamed up and prepared to go on to our travels to the new space station. I decide to ride as a passenger in his ship as my confidence in flying is at an all-time low. All the pressure was lifted from my shoulders. I was able to sit back as a co-pilot and observe until he said this. My mouse isn't working. Okay, honestly, you're gonna have to do it. You should be able to fly, actually. Are you sure that's a good idea, sir? Uh, well, I don't think we're really gonna have a choice here. You can't turn your mouse right now, like at all? Uh-uh. Go ahead and get in the driver's seat. I am in the driver's seat. Okay, so what am I doing? I hit F2. Okay, I hit F2. You see her L2 Faithful Dream Station. Now I see it. Hit route, route to this location. Yeah. Now that I routed it, I set my GPS technique so I can close this middle menu. So Yeah, you can hit F2. Yeah, so it's in, it's in quantum, so I'm allowing it to spool, calibrate, and then I'm gonna hold left click like now I can let go now right yeah huh we're here okay we're gonna have to get closer but uh try not to like zip in there I got you I gotta wait till I'm about 10 km and I'm gonna start going down on my uh my speed you see like a little thing that popped up on where to go Just slowly going I got you. I should be landed now. Um, I'm gonna... How do I turn off the... Ooh. You gotta hold control. Dude, that was stressful. Like, it was more stressful yeah. because it's not my ship. <laughs> That's like you having like a 2024 Mazda and be like, Hey man, dude, whatever you do, do not crash this fucking vehicle. You need to go find the medical place here. Just go to the medical place. Alright, check in. Yep. And then go to the room, lay on the bed. So that's it. Do I need to pick medical care, regeneration, any of that shit? Uh, regeneration. Um, primary resident facility transfer imprint? Yes. Now you will wake up here. So now, like, if we both log off right now, and we both log on tomorrow, we'll be we'll be here. Since we're both here, I mean, it wouldn't matter if we're both here or not, but once you're here, and if you log off here, you'll uh -huh. wake up here. But if you die out while you're doing a contract or something like that, it will bring you back to this spot. 
versus like new Babbage. So everything ended up working out in the end and we got to our destination safely. Now this game is intense on my PC, so I don't know how much I could dig into it, but time will tell. This game has tons of potential and I'll definitely become a star citizen.